hello 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 thank you guys so much for tuning in tapitha here and i have an influencer box to share with you if you guys don't know what influencer is basically you go on there and you just give your your honest reviews about different products and depending on how you respond and depending how active you are on the website i'm guessing and how far your social social reach goes for example you have to connect like your instagram all your social media outlets and they can figure a number how high your your social impact goes and i'm guessing they go off of that and then you will get different products coupons and things like that to review now if you guys remember maybe like a month ago i did like a quick little review on some country crock butter that i have already used in the past anyway that i used to make some cookies so a part a part of that campaign to get the badges and things like that which basically makes your score go up higher you get more badges and it all kind of circles or kind of goes back together with being able to do more campaigns I like doing product reviews i like giving my honest opinion about things so yeah it's you know i kind of enjoy doing these so this is my very first box from influencer if you guys hear that dinging in the background that's my phone i have no idea what is in this box so let's see Okay guys, so I am opening it up here. It's this cute little box. So the first thing I'm opening up is, let's see, Sunbake Bakery Fudge Dip Chocolate Chip Granola Bar. Bakery Fresh Taste. Said the suggested retail price is only 50 cents. It says sale by July 9th, 2016. So this is what it looks like here. I have never even had one of these. I've heard of the Sunbelt Bakery brand before, so guess what we about to do? We about to open this up right now, try it out, and see if this is good or not. Mm. Okay, y'all, this is good. Like, like this is good. It says Chewy Granola Bar, and that's exactly what it is. You get that chocolate right in there. Yeah, it's basically a granola bar dipped in chocolate. You guys can see, this is really good. No preservatives. How many calories? Because folks be trying to, you know, trying to watch their calories and whatnot. Serving size, it says calories 270 from fat calories is 110 so a little high on the calories i guess but i guess it's better than eating a cupcake <laughs> next thing is a not your mother's plump for joy thickening hair lifter for for fine thin hair volumizes strengthens and a luxurious shine this is in a two fluid ounce bottle what are you supposed to do it says for best results spray into palm rub hands together and then scrunch into the hair for from ends to root style as usual for a wavy look let hair dry natural or use a diffuser to dry hair can be used on damp or dry hair you know what i might actually try this the packaging is cute oh it kind of smells it has like a fruity smell to it it smells good we're gonna see you guys the next product is this cute little secret outlast at the invisible solid what's funny is i just had a campaign on this from buzzagent.com so i actually really like this this did not really give it wasn't really an invisible solid when it, i think of an invisible solid i mean it glow, goes on clear and stays on clear throughout the day so i'm gonna just try this out when i get out the shower tonight try this out for the next week again it's only like a travel size smaller than a travel size <laughs> but i'm gonna try it out and just see if it's different than the one i was sent from buzz agent but yeah and this is in the scent completely clean oh it's like a nice just like fresh scent really really like the smell of this so we're gonna see how this work y'all oh look at here next is the sinful shine with gel tech nail color so this is what the bottle looks like it's super pretty i love the little chrome top here color 1231 vip this is what they this is what was in the box 
it says they're only $2.99 at Walgreens. I actually saw these at Target as well. So there's that. So one would assume it's part of this collection. I don't know. But I don't think so because it says the sinful, sinful colors. And all the ones on here say sinful color on the box. So it's kind of confusing. I would think they would have sent me one of these. Or maybe they're just letting me know, hey, but that was weird. So the next thing it says, this is the Q-Tex One Step Pads. One pad cleans all 10 nails. Hmm. That's Revival Nail Polish Remover Pads. Strengthens and nourishes with botanical oils for natural nails. Three, three packs individually wrapped. So this is what it looks like. This is also the card you get, you guys, and it tells you what all the retail prices are for it. This particular product here ranges from $149 to $399. This product here is ranging from $299 to $399 as well. The Not Your Mother's Plump for Joy, this is normally, the two ounce bottle is $3, which is this. This little bottle is $3, and the seven ounce bottle is $8. This little secret outlast here, just the 2.6 uh, ounce, you guys, is $4.29. And then you guys know the granola bar that retails for $0.50. Cents. So let's see how this product's working. Y'all know, if you guys watch my product reviews, I'm going to keep it 100. 100. Last product, you guys, let's see what this is. This is the Nux, N-U-X-E. Not sure how to pronounce that. Huley progenous multi-purpose oil it says this dry oil nourishes repairs softens face body and hair in a single step with a concentration of six precious botanical oils and vitamin e this unique dry oil is quickly absorbed for silky smooth finish and beautiful glossy hair this is france leading beauty oil so glad that they put it in one of these plastic bags here because sometimes when you get stuff in the mail like this, it ends up spilling and it's just a hot mess. So this particular oil, you guys, the 50 milliliter bottle retails for $29. And the 100 milliliter retails for 45, for 45 bucks. So this is very expensive. They sent me a 0.33 ounce fluid, uh, fluid ounce bottle. So this... Is what it looks like and it, it did say it's for face body and hair so I am going to use it on all three to see how it works so packaging is super cute I love this I love the gold let's it's a little bit on a it's a little watery let's I'm gonna pour a little bit literally pour two drops and I'm just gonna rub it into my hands and see what type of moisture I can get it says it's a dry oil that's interesting It, do, it does have a very light scent, but it smells good, though. It, it smells really good. So I just used two drops on my hand just to kind of see what type of moisture I would get from it. It's not too bad. It's not greasy at all. That's pretty good. And that was just with two drops, so I'm pretty sure if I put a little more, I would, you know, get some better results. But not too bad. Not too bad. So, you guys, I'm pretty excited to use these products thank you so much influencer for sending me these products so now it's time for me to get online to and one thing you have to do as soon as you get the box you have to check the box in so you go to the website you check it in you review the products you share your opinions on it and things like that so i'm gonna get to that and get to using these products so and then they give you different hashtags that you can use so, for example, if you're going to use it or talk about it on Instagram, then they give you different hashtags. If you want to follow the Facebook page or Twitter, they give you the Twitter account and the Facebook page for each product. So, they really, really want to make sure that you are engaged and, yeah, make sure you're actually using these products and giving your honest opinion. And that's what it's all about. Give your honest opinion. Don't be lying. Keep it real. You know what I'm saying? Give 
if you guys ever get any of these boxes give your honest opinion because that's going to help somebody else if they want to buy these products especially this oil here that's normally $45 so yeah I'm excited to use these products this is hey guys so now I am going to try out the Q-Tech advanced nail polish remover pads three pads individually packed do come in this little box here so I'm gonna go ahead and take out one this is what it looks like and it says one pad cleans all ten nails these portable and convenient felt pads allow you to remove nail polish whenever and wherever you desire so it says it's complete with penna panela seed oil flaxseed and apricot kernel botanical oils strengthen and nourish your nails while quickly removing polish so let's go ahead and open it up this is what the pad looks like it's very moist <laughs> uh is this all that's oh i thought it was gonna open up another time but this is what it looks like oh oh my god it has a super strong smell oh super strong but uh i'm gonna go ahead and see if you guys don't want to watch my toesies but yeah i'm gonna go ahead and see if it's gonna remove all of the polish from my toes Okay guys, so it did get it off, I guess, good enough. Um, and sometimes it depends on the color. That was a little bit of a darker color, so I know sometimes in my personal use, it doesn't matter how hard you scrub, sometimes it's hard to get it off uh, a lot of the, the leftover residue, like my pinky toes. Uh, it was kind of uh, hard to get off that last little bit on both toes and they're still slightly discolored but overall the pad did what it's supposed to do it still has a little bit of moist moistness left to it so if I do a little bit more scrubbing I mean I probably could get the remaining off I broke my nail as you guys can see so if that's I have to get that I have to fix that after the video but yeah but overall these i mean they did what they were supposed to do the smell on this is super super strong as soon as you open it it is very overpowering so i do not like that one bit um i mean i understand it's a figano polish remover and it's going to have a scent to it and it's not going to be the most pleasant the most pleasant scent but man that was super strong but overall, this product, I guess it was okay. It, it did get all the, the color off of all 10 toes. I mean, basically. I mean, I can buff out the rest of this and, and all of that. So, yeah. So, I'm going to finish buffing this out. I took off the polish the best I could. I just used some uh, off-brand. I think this is like Target's like up and up brand I just used to get the rest of it off and and filed it and all that stuff so, so I'm gonna use this the sinful shine this was just one coat it was a tad bit sheer so I think I'm gonna go ahead and add a second coat change the 
said he's on the camera because I didn't like the lighting. But, as you guys can see, I'm not the best with putting on polish. But just for the sake of just trying this product out, I wanted to record it. So, I don't know if you can tell the difference. This foot right here has on two coats, the one I'm tapping. And this one just has on one coat. So, it's a little bit more vibrant on the left foot than the right. So, I'm going to go ahead and put another coat on the uh, my right foot. This is two coats apply. Like I said, I am not the best with apl with applying toe polish, but I will say I do like the color of it. You definitely need two coats with this. One coat is definitely not going to be enough. The first coat was a little bit sheer, so adding the second coat really made it pop. So this is a great color for spring. I'm, I'm actually really happy with the results and with the color payoff with for this. Would I purchase this? I probably would to be honest with you if I were to come across I know they have the sinful colors at Walgreens and I've seen them at Target a few targets as well so overall, I do like the sinful shine and that's pretty much all I'm going to say about that so thank you guys so much for watching and I'll check you guys out in the next video bye